Mine does not look like yours. What the hell did I do? This thing. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know yeah. what I'm talking about? When people be having the long things all the way back, it looked like that. Like, I don't know what I did. Whatever that, that feels out of place, just take the pen. Listen, this is what you do. Let me show you something. Okay. So if it's out of place, right? Let's say this is out of place. See that? You see this right here? Yeah. I'm going to take the pen at the tip of the place with our, and then just tuck it in. Well, I need to tuck in a whole piece so that I make it look like a bun and not a twist. I mean, I don't know what the devil I just did. And here's another one here. I'll take it and bring it in. I just went to the tip of the piece that was out. Johnny, mine is tragic. It's not tragic. It ain't. It ain't cute. You gotta get all the edges and stuff in the back there. The all back that. is messed up too. I'm talking about the front. Look at the front. I can't see really good. <laughs> Get that piece right there. I need to get all the pieces. <laughs> Here's a good thing about it. You can always take it down and start over and replace it. I definitely need to take it down and start over and replace it. And then get the back laying down with some gel or some holding spray even. Yeah. I need to I need to lay it down some. You know what I need? <laughs> this is where is my little brush? My, I love a regular old toothbrush, but this would be fun. That thing is great. I love this. That's good. It really lays it down nicely. Huh? I think it really lays it down nicely. Yeah. I love that. Um. Oof, this top knot needs some work. Oh, I got hair all over my face. Um. So what else could we tell? Them? What's the parting words for the people? All right, I so the last thing, and honestly, I feel like the most important thing I want to talk about, and I'll leave the hair like this, is this is a perfect opportunity to nourish and hydrate your hair. Yeah. And again, keep as much heat off your head as possible. Mm -hmm. So one of my favorite go-tos for hydration and for treatment is steam treatment. And what I love about the steam treatment is it is infusing moisture in your hair with moisture. Yeah. So you get that high intensity of hydration that you would not normally get if you just sat under the dryer. Okay? Yeah. And a lot of people don't have steam, you know, hooded steams at home. You can actually find them on Amazon. They're not too expensive. Ooh. You can get a tabletop hooded steamer that you can sit under and let it steam your face. It's great for your skin and it's also great for your hair. But if you don't have that, the best thing to do is get a hand towel, okay? You're going to soak this with water, and you're going to place it in the microwave for 30 minutes, okay? 30 minutes? One, 30, I was going to say 30 seconds. Child, you about to light to a, somebody's house on. I know. 30 seconds to, 30 seconds to a minute, you're going to leave it in. Once it, it dings, you don't want to grab it with your natural hand. You want to... Take a tongue, because you'll be in the kitchen. Take a tongue, bring it out, grab with the tongue, and then let it out just a little bit before you wrap it over your head. And you will see the steam coming out of the towel and also penetrating into your hair. You do that a couple of times, and you'll have your steam treatment. Use your favorite mask, whatever that mask is, or conditioner. Put that on. Make sure you saturate the hair really well with conditioner. Put that on. Do that about a couple of times. I say two to three times, and then you're done. Ooh, I'm gonna do that. Just that simple. I'm gonna do that today, Johnny. Yeah, right, you are. Do a steam treatment. Hmm. Definitely do a steam treatment. It's great you treatment. are a master stylist, a great <laughs> friend. <laughs> you ain't hardly cracked no jokes today, which I can't believe. Did I not? Oh my <laughs> you guys, Johnny normally is cracking all the jokes, and the only other thing we're missing is snacks cocktails and the blue six station you know we didn't play blue, blue six either the blue six station. no we didn't play blue six we Jesus, gotta we i have them add one. some music we'll have to add, have them add some music but this is great and um i don't know johnny this is really good they might want an encore we might have to figure this out again we might have to do another one yeah i might have to really, have to really show them how to use this mermaid waiver i this know awesome I'm scared of this that. I have, so cool. I have a thing, but I don't know how to use it. And then I have another thing I'm going to show you I don't know how to use. You know, I'd be going into Target and all these places buying stuff and don't know how to use it. 
You know what this would be cool? What? If we do another one, the encore would be gather all those things that you purchased because you thought it was on a whim, and then we learn how to use them. Hey. That's what we should do. Hey. Maybe people should should, should um, comment below and say that this is what they want to learn how to use that they bought years ago or even a couple of weeks ago. They mm -hmm. bought it on infomercial, QVC, agency, mm -hmm. or whatever, mm -hmm. and I don't know how to use it properly. What's the best way to use it? I can help you guys out. Bam. Johnny just developed his spinoff at the pilot. We had the pilot and he had a spin off. Because I ain't about to sit through all y'all's comments on all the stuff you don't know how to use. And Johnny has all that in his hair closet at home. Trust and believe. I have everything. <laughs>